Hey guys, so today I'm going to attempt to use my multi-tool as you can see I already started cutting this down. Well I'm going to try to uh, use this piece of board and uh, make like a, a little angle, like cut it at an angle to where I can sharpen my, my knives at like a 45 degree angle every time. So I'm going to go ahead and just start finish cutting this up. started it so Okay, so finally got it. Now, what I'm gonna try to do is, I guess, cut it at a diagonal from corner to corner, maybe a little bit less. I'm gonna try to keep it at 45 degrees, give or take. I'm gonna take all this, the shavings, and put it in this empty red crushed pepper of shavings for with a along with the uh, dryer lint and mixed petroleum jelly, candle wax, the, the shavings and the uh, dryer lint and they made some I guess kind of like the the trioxane kind of things how you just light it and lights a fire. I'm gonna try that out. It's not much. You know, just a little bit. So I'll go ahead and use this and try it out. Got a little bit. <clears throat> mm. 
or if I should just carve it out. I'm not sure. Hmm. I'll be back. Hmm.
had it like this now I'm gonna try it like this maybe that might work a little better maybe not Pretty clean cuts. For, you know, Leatherman, I never actually used one of these things to cut wood, but that was the first time, right? Sorry for the bad video takes, man. So you're probably asking why I didn't just turn this thing over? Well, that's a good question. Just want to make sure that I'm still going to be cutting at the same angle, you know? Just about there, almost. Whew. I'm like right there at the bottom already, almost to victory lane. Oh. 
trying to get stiff. It's trying to be harder and harder. Should have just put some WD-40 on this sucker. finish line oh man just about there Nice clean cut, except for that very end. Whew. Let's take a look. Pretty clean, except that very end, like I was saying. Whoa, yeah. Alright, so let me get this cleaned up and then we'll uh, test this out. Hmm. Not bad. First time I actually used this to cut any wood. It's pretty good. Has good lock up. So this is the Leatherman Blast. This Leatherman with this attached to it, the Sog Twitch XL or Twitch 2, I think. And that's how I have this every day. Now, what I was trying to do is have this at an angle to where when I'm sharpening it it'll remain at the constant angle so what I'm gonna do is probably just clean this up a little bit make it a little bit smoother and that should work I don't know let's try it out Working. I'm just going to test it on this one little piece right here and uh, see if it makes any difference. It's kind of awkward right now. See if you can even see that. 
see what it's doing is it's just keeping that at a straight up angle If it'll work for this Tonto. And you can still see the little chip that's on there. But uh, hopefully, I'll get it out with this. That little chip happened when I was using it to. Uh, do some stuff I shouldn't have been used for, so there goes that. Yeah, I guess it's going to work. There you have it.